I'll have to turn down the volume in just a minute. Settings. Yes, turn it down. Turn it down, thank you. Is that too loud? Is that good? Story? No, we're just gonna start. <clears throat> the Stocked. I had to break up with Liam. I hope he takes it well. Uh. Oh. Okay. Sorry, Liam. I need to make some food. I'm hungry. <laughs> that was our stomach. That was our stomach. Or the other one with the clown. A number? What was that? What was that sound? Oh my god. Three cooking games in a row? No. What the heck? What is that? Organic food. Oh, don't look bad. Who would be knocking at my door on this? Oh, okay. Who would be knocking on my door at this hour? What was that crash sound? Who's there? Hey, honey, can I come in? Ugh, Liam. I told you, it's over. So no, you can't come in. Come on, you can't just leave me like that. I love you more than anything. It's over, Liam. Just go home. <clears throat> Open the door, Kate. No, I'm not opening the door. I don't love you anymore, Liam. You will be mine again soon. <laughs> Shut up, Liam. <laughs> Sounds like you walked away. Thank God, now my food's burning. Lady Ripper, I'm here. The title. Hmm? What title? What's happening? <laughs> a bath to calm myself down a bit would be great right now. Food in a bath? We're on it. What is this place? <gasps> Found it. What was that? That's the same crash I heard earlier. Where's it coming from? <gasps> Give me another chance, please. I will treat you well and do anything you want. I promise. Just one chance is all I ask. That can't be too much, can it? Well... I mean, you already had a chance. Like, the first chance was your first chance. <laughs> no, no, no. I gotta leave before he makes it worse. Right? So this would be his second chance. What? Wait. What happened? <laughs> I... <laughs> Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Liam! He can just run through stuff? Okay, that's fine. That's fair. He can just... It's... Okay. <clears throat> we got this. Where would I go, though? Do I just run out here and jump this? Oh, well, that's... Okay. <sighs> go! We already know he's coming. Hey. First try. Did it. <laughs> We're driving. We've got a cell phone. Kate, we're, we're, we're not even looking at the road anymore. It's fine. Oh, 
Hello, Grandpa. I need your help. Hey, Kate, what's going on? Liam broke into my apartment and chased me. I barely got away on the first try. And now I'm in my car with nowhere to go. That's horrible. Are you okay? Did he hurt you or something? No, I got away before he could do something. But I'm terrified he will find me. Okay, I assume you're looking for a place to stay for a while. Yes. You can come live with me for as long as you need. However, I'm going to be out on a business trip for one week. That's fine. Still got to be safer than staying here. Can I go? There right now? Yes. I'll send you the address. The key to my house is in a flower pot. Also remember to keep the doors locked. And if you need to go outside, you can always check the peephole first. Okay. Thanks, Grandpa. You're a lifesaver. No problem. I hope all goes well. And don't hesitate to call me again. What are all these sounds I'm hearing in the background? If he can run through things, we should not be able to stop it. Right? <gasps> oh. Oh. I... Oh, I put my hands up so fast. <laughs> Liam, you... We're out of here. At least she wasn't driving during that whole conversation. <laughs> All right. Escaped Liam. For now. That was a close call. Thank God I made it out. Liam won't be able to find me anymore now. I have finally broken free from that toxic relationship. It must not have been that serious, though, if he doesn't know where Grandpa lives. Or does he? Dun, dun, dun. Oh no, did Liam manage to follow me here? I'm getting too paranoid now. Did that car just crash? Of course it's not him, it's probably the neighbor. <gasps> Dang, Grandpa was loaded, or is loaded. What the heck? We're staying in a mansion? He probably heard you from the window. <laughs> Press F to turn on your flashlight. All right. Okay. Our little getaway car. What was that? Oh wait, Grandpa said the key was in a flower pot. Okay. Grandpa? Did you lie? Nope, you didn't lie. Just kidding. He didn't lie. Wow, it's dark in here. Let's turn on some lights and find the bedroom. I want to hit the bed ASAP. I want to hit the bed ASAP. All right. We've got some light on. This place is huge. What is that? Oh, hell no. We got a bathroom. This one's locked. We need to remember that. <laughs> I think. Okay, well, is someone here? No. There's absolutely someone here. Liam, did you just break one of my grandpa's windows? Where would they be a window? There's these ones. <gasps> a peephole. Better safe than sorry. You use the peephole for the first time. Let's go. Getting these achievements. Find the bedroom. 
I want to find out what just made that shattering sound. Lock the door? The window again? What do you mean lock the door? Can I? Oh, hell no, that's not a thing. Are we already dead? Is it over? I don't think I want to go to sleep, you know what I mean? You turned on all the lights in the house, brighter days. Okay, but is that the bedroom? It is. I, I hope Liam is paying for those windows, right? It's morning. Wow, I slept that long. It's not even morning. It's almost four o'clock in the afternoon, in the evening. It's almost dinner time. What's going on? Is grandpa home? Kate. Someone's smashing windows and Kate's like, is that grandpa? No, Kate. No, Kate. It's not grandpa. Check the door. What are all these sounds? No. Wait, I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared. Okay. <clears throat> I literally have a mail slot. Dearest new resident, new resident of this mansion. A letter has been added to your collection. New resident of this mansion. I'm the previous owner of this mansion and you are the person I have been looking for. I hope to see you stick around for a while. I'm sure we will get along just fine. I'll be watching you. Watching me? This is the strangest thing to say. This is strange, to say the least. I need to get going to the store before it gets dark, though. Let's be careful. Hey, someone said they're watching us. And you're like, I want to go to the store. Crazy. How many windows? Okay. How many windows have been broken? That's a lot. The convenience store. What's that? Some kind of paper? What? Okay. Check out the paper. A poster has been added to your collection. You found the missing person poster. Wow, it's creepy how similar she looks to me. Ashley missing since 8-15-2013. Please help us bring Ashley home. If you have any information, even the smallest detail, contact the police. Your assistance could make all the difference. This is horrible. I hope they found her. Press tab to look at the shopping list. Canned food, snacks, soda, milk, cereal. And why, why am I going so slow? Automatic doors, let's go. Sir, 
Oh, it's an ATM. You're fine. Why is my walking speed so messed up? Buy groceries. Do I need a, a situation? From top to bottom, canned food. I guess not. <gasps> okay. Snacks. I'm just going to hold all these? It's going to yell at me. Watch. Soda. I lied. Milk, cereal, wine. <sighs> Not the convenience store windows. <laughs> milk. Shelf milk? Shelf milk. Okay. Cereal. And wine. Y'all drink that shelf milk? Let's go pay for this. Hey, hello. How are you? Is that all? Yes. All right. The total is $22.50. Thank you for shopping here. Also, I can tell you're new to the area. How long are you staying for? No problem. I'm not sure yet. Not too long, I would assume. All right. Have a good day. Here are your groceries. Thanks. You too. Kate? Stop talking to strangers. He said, I can tell you're new here. <laughs> oh, I thought that was Liam. We have, we have Liam PTSD. You know, a young, beautiful lady like you. Shouldn't be out all alone like this. What's the name of this game? This is called The Stocked on Steam. <laughs> what do you want? I do have some wishes, but I think it's best they remain unspoken. <laughs> Why would he be running at you like that, right? Be careful and don't let me catch you all alone again. Sir. I'm about to smash you over this head over the head with this bag. This bag of groceries won't take you out. But not Kate. Kate's gonna be like, mm -hmm, I'll be alone tomorrow. I don't need your warnings. Respect my space and stay away. Good on you, Kate. Dang. I didn't think she had it in her. <laughs> Sir, there's a thing called walking. Try it sometime. I know, right? And then threatened us. Threatened us to our face. Said, don't let me catch you out alone. Or what, sir? Or what? Okay. We've locked it. We've unlocked it. We're shutting it. And we're locking it. Someone's here. Someone's here. Oh my god. Kate, get that bag ready, Kate. I no, I didn't say put that phone away. Kate, it's fucking go time. Do we have anything? Perfect. Unknown, unknown number. Welcome home. you mean welcome home you looked beautiful in the store today <laughs> what game this is called the stocked can't wait to see you again getting closer mining is he inside or out kate he's, he's inside kate Kate, he's inside the house. 
Kate, go. Run upstairs. I'm soon there. Or what if? I'm already there. Yep. Yep. He's already here. Can I lock it? Nope. Perfect. Can we hide under the bed? Kate, go to sleep. Kate, take cover. I'm here. Check the door. What if it's not Liam, but someone else? We must be a super damn fine then, because we've got all the dudes in town stalking us. Or we're literally the only female just trying to live our life. Hide from one, and there's another one. Tell him give you money for the windows. <laughs> right? What do you mean check the door? It's locked, right? Yes, that's now it's not. Now it is. What other door? This door? I can open it. There's no um people on it though. I'm here, he said. Okay, well, I'm just going to open it then, because... Okay, don't play around. Oh! A letter has been added to your collection, dearest new resident. Congratulations on settling in. You may believe this mansion is your refuge. But every step you take reveals a deeper game. I'm with you in every choice, every move. There's no escape from becoming mine. This is getting out of hand. I need to drive away and call the police before it's too late. Drive away, Kate. What's happening? No, not now. Start. Start. Please start. Come on. Why now of all times? Something is really wrong. I have to get inside and call the cops like right now. It's too late. It's too late. What did it say? Wait, how do I call the cops? Press F to call the police. It's too late. We have no light. Help. Nine one one. What is your emergency? Hi. I. I need help. I've been receiving threatening messages, letters, and texts. I'm really scared. I'm here to help you. Please provide your location. I'm at. It's urgent. <laughs> I understand. I'm dispatching officers to your location right away. Can you describe the nature of the threats? They've been watching me, following me. The messages are getting more intense. Please hurry. Stay on the line with me. Help is on the way. In the meantime, try to find a safe and secure location within your home and make sure to lock your doors. The officers should be there soon. What's that sound? Is that my heart beating? Let's go upstairs, Kate. They're locked. Please hurry. Help is on the way. Didn't I just do that? Someone just tried to open the door. Officers will be there any second now. I don't have anywhere to hide. Shit. I guess I don't need to hide. We're fine. It appears that everything is under control now. Our officers apprehended a man in a white van outside your residence. We're bringing him in for questioning. If something else happens, don't hesitate to call us. Take care. Thank you for your help. I'll be sure to reach out if something else happens. In no world ever. 
feel what a relief. I never thought I'd feel safe again, but maybe things can get back to normal now. It should be safe now. Let's head to the basement outside and restore the power. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> let's do that, Kate. Go out back. Kate, where's the basement? <gasps> okay, first of all, it's open. Second of all... Isn't that a storm shelter? Kate, if you go down there, we're dead. Just letting you know. We're fine. We're good. What's that? <gasps> Do not open. The power should be back on now. Something's off. Another crash of a window. I left the door wide open. Hey, Axel. The stink of sweat. Let's take a bath before we go to sleep. I didn't turn on that light. <gasps> I did not turn on that light. Kate, if you get in that bath, we're dead. Okay. <laughs> Finally, a moment of peace. Famous last words. Right? But why would that stranger go so far from me? Whatever. It's over now. Huh? I'm so exhausted that I'm hearing things now. Let's just go to bed. A camera? Someone took our photo? Our bath photo? Is there a hidden camera in here? Why is it so dark? Was that light on the whole time? Maybe. All right, we made it to bed. Even though we've got some stuff going on, <laughs> we're still gonna go to sleep. <laughs> what is that noise? Which one, Kate? Sounds like it's coming from the storage room. Investigate the noise. Probably more glass, right? <laughs> Do you mean the storage room? Where was that at? Is that downstairs? Yeah. Of course it's downstairs. Here we go. The door shut now? <gasps> oh, freaking nightmare. 
We're fine. <laughs> Oh my god. I should probably call to check how Liam is doing. I mean, the reason all this is happening to begin with is because I broke up with him. It's all my fault. If I had just stayed with Liam, he would have kept me safe. N no, we're not doing that. No, of course not. What am I thinking? Let's put my mind on something else. But first, let's make sure this house is empty. I still don't feel safe. Okay, I'm thinking the dev just has a thing for broken glass. It's just like the sound they opted for. So you know what? Just every 30 seconds, add in some broken glass. <laughs> Sounders, why not? <laughs> why not? All right. The house is secure. Maybe. We're fine. Something looks off about that book. You found a hidden r Grandpa? What the sheesh? Look, honey. We made the news. Pretty cool, right? 8 17 2013. Two days after that girl went missing? A sudden disappearance. Ashley's whereabouts are unknown. 27-year-old Ashley was reported missing on August 15th, 2013 by her husband. Two days after she disappeared from their home, last seen in their residence. <gasps> Grandpa's house? Ashley's sudden absence has raised suspicion with her husband emerging as the prime person of interest in the ongoing investigation. While authorities continue to search for leads, they urge anyone with information to come forward and assist in the search for Ashley. I can't replace you, Ashley. There is no one that is, spe that is as special as you. Why did you force me to do this? I never wanted to harm you. My fault? How is it my fault? How is it my fault? I didn't want it to end like this. You left me with no other option than gaslighting. What the fuck did I do? How am I going to live without you? What is the point of all this? I'm typing to a dead person. I would do anything to get you back. Am I dreaming? I swear that is you. She looks just like you. Have you come back to me 10 years later? She is just as beautiful as you were. She has to become mine. She will. No matter what, I can't let her run away from me like you once did. Kate! It's time to go, Kate! Just kidding. Why would you want me to leave? I have done nothing but be good to you. Whatever. It doesn't matter anymore. You are never leaving me again. It's probably about time I talk to Grandpa about what's going on here. This is crazy. Hey, yo, Pops. We got a situation at uh, Casa Mansion. He's definitely talking to you. What? Grandpa, are you there? Yes. Has something happened? A lot has been happening. I'm receiving creepy letters and being followed by someone I don't think is Liam. I called the police and they arrested a suspicious individual lurking around the house. But when I thought it was all over, I found a strange hidden room in your house that contains some psychotic things to say the least. What? 
This is insane. <laughs> Maybe the police arrested the guy leaving the letters. And a hidden room? I've lived there for 10 years and I've never seen that. I'll be cutting this business trip short and coming home ASAP. I can't stand not being able to help you. I'd like to think they arrested him, but what if they didn't? What if he's still out there? What if they arrested someone who got upset? Wait, that's not what it says. What if they arrested someone who got set up? It makes me so uneasy just thinking about it. What do you remember about the person that you bought this place from? That could definitely be the case. I remember that his wife had recently gone missing without a trace. It was the talk of the town for quite a while. And his name was... Are you serious? My phone ran out of battery and I didn't have time to bring my charger with me. Let's go find a flashlight in case I need one later. I think I remember seeing one in the basement. Find a flashlight. It's go time. All right, we did see one in the basement. By the way, we did. Unlock and go. Also, are we thinking it's grandpa? Is this this guy's wife? Did the guy's wife, or did the guy's, the wife's husband do this? Is it the wife's husband? Was it the guy at the convenience store? Damn crows. More glass. It's fine. Is Grandpa working with the man? I should search for a weapon just in case. Let's start by looking through Grandpa's office upstairs. Yes, Kate. Yes. Let's go. Kate's about to turn into a badass. What was that? Grandpa's desk. We got some chips. Kill. There's nothing of use in here. Great. Where else can we look? Kate, the kitchen. That has to be Grandpa, right? Someone's knocking at the door. We're gonna peep it. <gasps> God damn it. It's the stranger from the convenience store. Hi. Sorry if I scared you. I just had to come clean about something. I read that weird. I read that weird. Maybe it's the stranger we saw it is. Emma, hi. The game is The Stalked. All right. <clears throat> hi. Sorry if I scared you. I just had to come clean about something. Of course you did. You're the creep that talked to me earlier outside the convenience store. What do you want to come clean about? I know it was creepy, but it wasn't my idea. Liam told me to do it in hopes that you would take him back to feel safe again. I was supposed to take it a step further now, but I couldn't do it. I felt too sorry for you. Courtney! Hey, girl! It all makes a lot more sense now. Thank you for telling me. I still don't feel safe around you. Can you leave now, please? Yes, of course. I'm sorry, again. Oh, no, you're not. This guy's not sorry. He's not. We're about to find out.
All right. Flashlight. Really? It's night already? Go to bed. All right. Here we go. Do we believe the convenience site, the convenience store guy's story? Did that come from the bedroom door? Did what? Do we think Liam set him up? <gasps> you thought this was over? You feel helpless now, don't you? Your car doesn't work, your phone is dead, the police think they got the person behind this, and you don't know where I am. There is nothing that can stop me anymore. <sighs> what do I do? I know. If I follow down the other path I saw when I first got here, maybe I can find some neighbors that can help me. Follow the other path? What? Other path? What? What's happening right now? I'm going out the side door. I'm... I'm going... I'm going out the side door? The other path? What does that even mean? Emma with the fruit friends. Thank you so much. <laughs> Other path. Left to right. Le left to right. We're going left. We always go left. Oh, wait. Always go left. <laughs> Thank you so much for that fruit friends. That was so freaking cute. <gasps> it's the car. I mean, I don't know why they had to crash into that. <gasps> what is that? <gasps> what is that? Is it a fucking tunnel that leads to the house? Ain't no way. Ain't no way. This butthole dug a tunnel all the way to Gra Blood. Where? Hello? I should follow the blood before going in deeper. Before going deeper in. Follow the blood. Who's that? You found Liam's body? Why would someone do this to you? She is mine. And only mine. That's crazy. Plot twist. <laughs> we got we got our shift. We got our shift now. And I'm kind of turned around. What happened? Wait. Are we going deeper or are we going back out? I feel like I messed up. I did mess up. I'm lost. I can't figure it out. There we go. We'll get it. We'll get there. All right. There was Liam. This goes back to the house. I'm, I can't. That's the trap door behind the bookcase. The secret, the secret bookcase. Is this Ashley? Her head was in the box in the ring. 
I think these are Ashley's remains. What a sick and twisted individual her husband is. I don't even want to know what he'd do to me. Me bouts to find out. Can I get up there? No, can't wait. Can I? It sort of felt like I was climbing, but now it doesn't. <gasps> oh! Cashier? Hey, I couldn't wait anymore. I need you now, my new Ashley. So, it, it was you that's been sending the letters? I know I look similar to your ex-wife, but that doesn't mean I can replace her. I don't care. How you look is more than enough. Come here. I've been waiting for so long for this. No, I have to run before it's too late. Fuck. We're done. Didn't even... God damn it. Fucking Kate. Who just stands there? Kate does. Kate just stands there. <laughs> I jumped. The cashier? The cashier? Ain't no way. Mal, the game is the stocked. All right. All right. I have to run before it's too late. Kate, go. Go, Kate, go. Go, Kate, go. Go, Kate, go. Cops. What you gonna do now? Well done. Survived the stalking. The police arrived on the scene just in time, thanks to Grandpa. He hurried back home after the abrupt ending to Kate's phone call with him. When he arrived home, he realized that Kate was nowhere to be seen. He got a sinking gut feeling that the worst might have happened. He called the police instantly, and they made it just in time. The relief Grandpa felt after the news was like nothing else. What happened to everyone else involved? The man in the white van said that his reasonings for being outside Kate's home was because he saw a stranger following her from the store. Of course, the police didn't believe him when they saw no one else was there. But when the news broke free about this, the police realized their mistake and that he actually been telling the truth. He was, he was released the same day. He was realized. Liam's accomplice was never seen again after the incident. The psychopath who killed his ex-wife Ashley, Liam, and almost Kate, ended up getting sentenced to life in prison. Kate is doing her best to recover from the incident, but it's difficult. At night, she often hears those daunting knocks on her bedroom door, disrupting her attempts to sleep. Throughout every day, she finds herself checking behind and scanning every corner, consumed by fear and paranoia. And don't forget, the sound of breaking glass. 